to fulfill the purpose of our life, to become servants of Allah, we need to turn away from dunya. And to truly learn how to turn away from dunya, we need to turn to Sayyidul Anbiya wal Mursaleen, the leader of the prophets and messengers, Khayrul Awwaleen wal Akhirin, the best of the first and the last. Sayyiduna Muhammadur Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. So that's why he's written this book. For us to, from the hadith of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, to implement this and via implementing the hadith, turn away from dunya and truly become servants of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Imam At-Tirmidhi uh, narrates this hadith Fi qalbi kullimri in muslimin mawa'idullah In the heart of every believing person is the message of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala Is the mess are the messages or admonition of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala So when that thought enters your heart, it's not you It's Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala saying to you is, Don't you want to turn back now? Don't you want to turn back now? You shouldn't have done that. Don't you want to turn back now? Don't you want to turn back now? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is telling you again and again, turn back, turn back, turn back. But Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in the Quran also says, وَلَا تَكُونُوا كَالَّذِينَ نَسُوا اللَّهِ لَا تَكُونُوا Do not be كَالَّذِينَ نَسُوا اللَّهِ Do not be like the ones who have forgotten Allah. He stretches out his hand in the night means his mercy is spread out throughout the night. Why? Allahu Akbar. That the one who sinned, you know the word Masih here means, in itself it holds a meaning. The one who sinned for the entire day, if he wants to turn back to Allah, in a moment in the night he can still turn back to Allah. Masih layl in itself holds the meaning, the one who not done one sin in the night, he sinned from sunset to sunrise, continuously sinned throughout this time, but the day broke out and he thought, I need to turn back to Allah. If he sinned non-stop throughout the night, with one toba he can turn back to Allah. With one toba he can turn back to Allah, subhanahu wa ta'ala. How much does Allah love us? How much does Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala love us? And how bad must we be to not love him back? To not want to turn back to him subhanahu wa ta'ala. We mentioned this point in the previous chapter. How easy is it to connect to Allah? How difficult is it to break the connection with Allah?